new video this video is regarding magix manager how you guys can install magix manager on our devices and how you can root any android devices so let's get it started we have another latest update which is 26 very 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 latest one let's get it started and if you are using 25.2 24.3 or any other older version then you can upgrade it easily just follow the video process First of all, download the file from the given link in description. And before we start, I just want to show you the magic change log which is available on 26. Actually, 26 version already supported Android 14. We have support Android 14 in 26 magic. And so many fixes and changes has been done in that 26 version. So here is the changes. If you want to uh, read the change log, then I will provide the link in description. Or you guys can pause the video and can check that thing first one which is very general bump minimum supported android version to android 6.0 that means if your android version is 6 then of course you can use that 26 version if your android version is below android version 6 which is uh, marshmallow i guess uh, uh, if, if you're using marshmallow then you can use it and then we have another one magic mount backend it supports a loading modules into system with overlays files injected it's very very easier one the general one mounted backend uh, in supports loading modules we can uh, load modules right now if from system easily and jazz exchanges has been uh, done here jazz new api version has been released and prevent crashing daemon in error so before uh, we face some issues we are using jazz due to jazz we uh, faces some issues with some magic modules but in that one everything got fixed so these are the change logs and the last one is update rules to support android u that means android 14 supported now let's boot your device into recovery then we are going to flash you guys will get the zip file or apk file remember if you are getting or if you are downloading apk file then rename it to zip file uh, you, you, when you are going to flash through the magic uh, flash through the recovery you must rename your apk file to zip of course ma uh, recovery cannot flash the apk file it can flash zip file so you have to rename it and i already did it so i'm just putting my device into recovery so device booted into recovery i have to enter password for encryption so let it be encrypted it's encryption issues so that's why we are trying decryption so per uh, perfectly decrypted and here is the magic the latest one apk file you guys can see here if you are getting apk like me then I'll just rename it like this and just type zip and click down so it's now in zip format just click and flash and let it be flash it will be flash automatically so don't worry about that and when you are done just click on reboot system and your device is uh, ready to use magic after boot just don't skip the video right now i have to show something more after booting so flashing process already done here you guys can see the reboot system just click on it i'm skipping that part i'm using here the moki rom which is android 11 you guys can use uh, this on any android version no issues with that so finally device already booted now let me show you the magic here is the magic but it's now in uh, invisible format like if you want to click on it it will ask to download so remember one thing when it will ask to download just click on ok if your internet connection is ok if you don't have any internet connection when you are flashing uh, the magic then click on cancel and get back to files and go to the folder where you have stored your magic and here is the magic one and rename it to apk again 
previously we had apk format and we made it zip then we will rename it again to apk so it's now in apk format just click on apk form apk to download uh, sorry install it manually just install like normal apk and when you are done just click on done and get back now your matrix is ready to use just click on it and it will ask to require additional setup uh, if you want to do additional setup then you have to reboot your device so just click on reboot ok it will be uh, done and if you don't want to then of course you just can use it just go to settings enable jizis and force denialist and then of course you can reboot your device your device is ready to use it so this is the video for today hope you guys understand the video if you like my work then do subscribe and hit the bell icon so thank you for watching